Will Smith's fans as of late. Like, yeah. what is your issue with them? My issue is that um, one, one is like, first of all, they scared of each other. I tell the fans, y'all scared of each other. Y'all probably happy that they didn't fight, so yep, not on risk. But they, my issue is with them is that they just delusional and they scared for their fighter to take a lose. When you bring up Boots, there's all types of lame ass excuses from both ends. Oh yeah, he's not ready yet. Dude, Boots is 25 years old. He been in the ring. Is he number one, number two? Spence fans, did y'all say that against Carlos Acampo? I never heard him say, yeah, Carlos Acampo's not ready, man. I'm mad about this fight. Blood fans, did y'all say that when y'all fucking fought? Who, who, I, did he even fight a mean machine? Who did mean machine fight? Avenesian? He had a draw. No, he fought Avenesian after. Yeah. He had a draw with Ray well, Robinson. Ray Robinson, yeah, he fought Avenesian after Crawford. Yeah. Yeah, like, I didn't hear no complaint. Like, yeah, Mean me Machine don't deserve it. Like, y'all just scared because y'all see this young bull more talented than him and knowing that it's a big risk that they're going to lose. So y'all make lame-ass excuses. That's why I be getting on Spence and um, Crawford fans. Now, I actually like Spence and Crawford as people and as fighters. I just trying to say like, yo, stop being fans. It's just great to be fans of boxers, but we want to see great fights. We don't want to see no, no mismatches and all that shit. That's the reason why I be getting on them. Yeah, they don't like you very much. <laughs> I'm going to give them more reason not to like me then. I'm going to, every time they come on these posts and, you know, I'll be on them Facebook groups and all that, I'm going to troll them even more. So I'm going to give them more of a reason not to like me. You got a message you want to send? Um, stop being fanagers. Um, if there ever was a fight, Wu Sai just enjoy the shit. Be happy that you witnessed the shit. The young boy boots. People be like, I'm biased because you know, no, I'm not biased to none of this shit. Recognize talent when you see it. Y'all recognize this shit, but y'all delusion eyes. Oh my god, oh my god, he's doing jumping check hooks doing uppercuts all the shit he's doing shit that you haven't seen since roy jones and that scares him like oh my god he's not ready he's doing it we fighting mm -hmm. fucking lip and is better than fucking 95 percent of buzz resume i'm gonna be 100 with that fucking who else uh besides when when spence was coming up he fought algeri and, and bondu and then you heard the spence fans putting that shit on keith thurman yeah fight him this and that Imagine if Keith, when when Keith Thurman was making all the excuses, y'all was mad at him. But imagine when uh, if Keith Thurman would have said, "Oh yeah, Spence ain't ready yet," y'all would have been mad like, "Oh yeah, he's bitching." Y'all doing the same shit with Spence and um, Bud. Let's go. And it come to him. <laughs> Why is your boots? Oh, no. Huh? I said, "Who's in the treadmill?" No. Yo, Boots. Yo. Come here real quick. You about to wound you up. <laughs> Yo, tell these buds and spins fans, stop being scared. Stop bitching because y'all see generational talent right here. Stop bitching. <laughs> they ain't scared of the smoke. Come on. Tell them, stop bitching, man. Y'all. Y'all scared of the smoke. Bud clowns, Spence ponies. All y'all talking shit on the internet saying he's not ready yet. He's 25 years old. He's number one in the rankings. He's been ready since he was like 20, 21 years old. I've been telling y'all asses since he beat Raymond Serrano what was going to happen. Y'all go back, what is that, 2015, 16? Yeah, like 18. 18? I've been telling him since like when he first turned pro. But yeah, 18, I told people, they was like, oh yeah, who's Boost? I said it was going to happen. Y'all about to be scared, and now y'all scared. There you go. <laughs> so stop bitching. <laughs>